Hi, my name is Tom Alpel, and I am super excited about my new book. It just came back from the printer today, and it really turned out gorgeous, better than I really ever could have imagined it. You know, that's the thing, is that uh, as a writer and a publisher, I put hundreds and hundreds of hours into a project like this, uh, but I never really know what I'm going to have until I see it in print and I'm holding it in hand. Uh, screen colors are different than print colors, so it, it's really... You know, it's always a bit of a mystery, and I'm holding my breath until I get it back from the printer. And I have to say, I think that this is the, the most beautiful book that I've ever published. So I'm excited about that. Uh, the colors are vibrant. Uh, the pictures just uh, pop off the page. And when I flip through the book and look at the text, I, I just want to sit down and read it all again, even though I've read it a million times already. So uh, I'm super excited about this and really excited to share it with you now. Five months in the Missouri River is as close as you can get to experiencing the full length of America's longest river without having yet paddled it yourself. This whole journey started when I teamed up with Churchill Clark, the great-great-great-great-grandson of Captain William Clark of the Lewis and Clark Expedition. We took a whole spring and summer to carve out this beautiful canoe from a gigantic 10,000-pound Douglas fir log. Uh, then I enlisted uh, friends and, and former students to join me on a Missouri River Corps of Rediscovery to paddle down the Missouri and to explore it much as Lewis and Clark did 200 years ago. Uh, in other words, the goal wasn't just to get to the end, but to really, truly experience the river along the way uh, by getting out and, and hiking and uh, studying the plants and foraging for wild foods, uh, seeing the wildlife and uh, discovering the, the history and meeting people along the way. The book includes 36 chapters and more than 700 photos chronicling the expedition and the river from one end to the other. And I'd like to show you a few pages from the journey. Uh, turning to the chapter Forts and Villages, we find ourselves in the middle of North Dakota. And if you look at the top of the page, you'll see that it is labeled with our location in North Dakota, the date August 17th, and that we've paddled from Garrison Dam to Knife River Indian Villages National Historic Site. Uh, here we toured the uh, traditional earth lodges and uh, saw the Three Sisters Gardens with the corn, beans, and squash that the um, Mandan Indians grew and stored in their caches thousands and thousands of bushels of dried corn, beans, and squash. Turning the page again, we find ourselves uh, downstream at Cross Ranch State Park, where we camped, uh, explored area trails, foraged for wild grapes, and enjoyed the beautiful nature scenery. Paddling the Missouri River is a lot like exploring a 2,000 mile long national park. So whether you are an avid paddler who dreams of doing the Missouri yourself, or an armchair adventurer, I invite you to join us for the adventure of a lifetime. Go to our website www.hopspress.com to pick up your copy of Five Months on the Missouri River, as well as my books on wilderness survival, nature, and sustainable living, and be sure to check out our package deals that are not found anywhere else.